What's so funny? <laughs> Pause. I tell you what's funny, baby doll, is Philly Five Hundred and his bird poop gang thought they was real slick and real funny when they came and got Pizzle strapped. Seeing how Pizzle's a nice guy, we sent him a taste of Pizzle along with the strap. A little gift so that he can know what 60 minutes tastes like. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Little baby dog, can I get a whistle? <laughs> and so, I watched him. I watched him taste Pizzle. I watched him, I watched him celebrate with the strap. Sit back here, read the comments, everybody saying what they want to say, this and that. But you know what's funny? What, what, what me and the kids are getting a laugh out of? Mm. <laughs> Little baby dog whistle. <laughs> Ever since he's had that strap, Megles ain't been doing too hot. <laughs> Maybe Fizzle did this the whole time. <laughs> Pause. Maybe Fizzle knew something the whole time. A little voodoo magic. And see, here Eagle fans sit. Philly 500 himself, Lord Bronson, the little E Rock, here they sit, wondering what's gonna how how are they gonna feel come next Monday? <laughs> little baby dog whistle. <laughs> how are they gonna feel? Are they gonna be the number one seed? Are they gonna fall down a little bit? Do they have to play in the wild card round? Do they not have to play? Let's be real and let's be honest about something. Let's be truthful, okay? After all the Eagles have done to us, all the pain they've caused us, all the torment, all this and that, and then kicking our butt the way they kicked our butt, you don't think some giant players and coaching staff and the fan base, you don't think they want a little payback for that little baby dog whistle? A little slow, but that's okay. That's okay. But see, it's real simple. See, people all want to know what's going to happen. Are we playing players or are we not? See, Brian Dable can come out and say, yeah, we're playing. Yeah, we're not. He can say whatever he wants to, but as you know, baby doll, mm -hmm. a man can tell you he's a 60-minute man, but... He got to show that to you. You know what I'm saying? Little baby doll whistle. See, the proof is always going to be in the pudding. You can talk about it, but be about it. That's a 60-minute man lifestyle. So he can say one thing, but we don't really know until they kick off. Mm -hmm. The fate of the Philadelphia Eagles and the destination of their playoffs all come down to us. It's up to us what we want to give you, Philly. Did Pizzle curse you? Did he put a little spell on you? All that smoke that was going in the air and you sitting there talking about how, oh, Pizzle tastes so sweet. Was that a little something to that? Was that false hope? Was that a false sense of security? And here you are, week 18. And see, we're like, you and I, we're like a duck on a pond. See, on, on the surface up top, the giants, we're calm. We're as calm as can be. But underneath the water, you guys are flapping. Oh, you're flapping fast. Little baby doll whistle. 
What's his problem? So I want you to know something, Philly. And I know everybody's sad right now because of what's going on with Hamlin on the uh, on the Buffalo Bills. I know everybody's sad, and we should be sad. It's a sad situation. But I want you to understand something when you put your head on your pillow tonight and you count your blessings and you think about Pizzle and you think about that 60 minutes and you think about all those things. And I know, I know what you've been trying to do with that Strat Philly 500, but best believe you don't do it like Pizzle. But understand this, your fate and what happens on Sunday and how you feel come next Monday, that is all up to the New York football giants. And I want you to think about all the things you've done to us and all the pain that you've caused. And I want you to realize something. That whether we get you this week or we get you in the postseason, we gonna get you. Oh, we gonna get you. Little baby doll. <whistles> What's this guy's deal? Can I get a whistle? <whistles> so sleep tight, Philly 500. Sleep tight, you turd bird gang. I want you guys to sleep well tonight. Think about. Think about. Think about what Pizzle just told you. Understand that we may let you guys have this number one seed. We may. And Philly, listen. I'm thinking. Because people want to know, what are you guys going to do? What are we going to do for a bet? Hmm? Maybe we can spin. Because we, we got a destination together in the playoffs. Best believe that no matter what happens on Sunday, you and I, pal, the Birds and the Giants, we playing in the postseason. It's happening. I feel it. I can feel it in the air. I really can. I can sense it. Like the, like the time I saw y'all's mama for the first time, I knew that she was just the one. Little baby dog whistle. <laughs> so sleep tight, Philly 500. Enjoy thinking about Pizzle.